Asad says, is it prohibited to reply to Salam while Friday sermon is given? The scholars say that the hadith of the Prophet والسلام, where he says, whoever says to his brother, meaning the person, the worshiper sitting next to you, shh, sah, yani do not speak, then he has committed laghu. He has committed an act that would discredit his attendance to the khutbah and would uh, uh, waver his reward away. Scholars said when commenting on this hadith that it is not permissible for a Muslim to reply to a salam. So while you're listening to the sermon, a man comes and says, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. It is not permissible for you to say, Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullah. You have to remain silent. If someone sneezes and says, Alhamdulillah, you must not say, Yarhamukumullah. And all of this is not part of the permissible things to do because it would be considered speaking. If someone is sitting, for example, leaning on his left palm, so he's doing this behind his back, this is the way that the Jews sit, as the Prophet said, والسلام, you are not allowed to say, this is not permissible, because this is communication. You may say that, or you should say that, after Salah is over, or when the sermon is over at least, but not during which. So what about if the Imam, while speaking, he says, and the Prophet وسلم, said, Shall we offer salutation? The answer is yes. Offer salutation, but do not make it audible. You don't say loud. You just simply say it by moving your tongue and lips by saying, for example, that's, that is sufficient and Allah knows best. Fine.